I helped form a club in, in my hometown in California and was able to have some, some relative success with, with the group that I was with. Through that, uh, as a lot of people do, meet some college coaches and make some connections. And one of the connections I made was actually to, at the time, it was the University of Pacific head coach, his name, been named John Dunning. He became the Stanford head coach. And at some point when it was, when it was right for both of us, he offered me the volunteer assistant job at Stanford. Um, we were fortunate enough to win the 2004 national championship in my, in my first season there. I spent another season at Stanford and I uh, got offered an assistant coaching job at the University of South Carolina and it was an opportunity that I felt was necessary for my growth in, in college athletics and, and I took that job and, and we, we did a, a relatively good job of turning that around, um, had some decent success there and, and actually what happened was I decided to go back to grad, I wanted to go to graduate school and that, that led me to my next job which was the College of Charleston, assistant coach at College of Charleston because I, I actually entered the graduate school at the, the Citadel and it so happened that the timing was right that I was able to get a, a job at the College of Charleston, which was wonderful. And, uh, and then that led me here to Mercer. Well, number one, what attracted me to the job was that sand volleyball was part of the deal. And I've had some experience in it at, at, at the University of South Carolina. I had to sort of start from scratch a sand program um, that was successful in, in what we did. We had a tournament at the end of the year for the SEC and we were able to win that after starting from scratch for the SAN program there. Um, so that initially, just in the job offering, was, was something that I thought would be really neat to be part of, be sort of a, a groundbreaker in the SAN part. Once I got here and, and did my interview and met the people, that was, that's sort of what, what turned me. Um, the administration um, the athletic director and the senior women's administrator were just, they, they made me realize their vision for Mercer and uh, it sort of hooked me. I, the facilities are amazing, the school is amazing, and, and I think everybody's on board here to, to do the right thing for, not only for women's volleyball, for, for the athletic department. I think specific to Mercer, I actually, I, I, I've been saying this quote in my mind for the last week and a half, and it was Ron Jaworski, of all people. It wasn't Socrates, it was Ron Jaworski. And he, last year, or last week, he had talked about a program, football program, wanting pioneers and not historians, and that they were gonna hire a coach that, that was had that sort of, sort of same philosophy. And I think that's where I am. I want, my philosophy, yeah, I can say it's, I want the girls to work harder, but they might work hard already. I can say I want them to be accountable. They might be accountable already. I'm going I'm to do those things. But I want, I want people who are willing to get on board with me being a pioneer, not just for Mercer, but for, for volleyball in general. I, I'm, I'm always reflecting on how I can do something different, how, how I can say something different, how I don't use the keywords that people have been using for 20 years to get points across. Um, and I'm... I sort of fancy myself as a as someone who, that counted on work ethic to be successful, and so I'm I'm going to count on that for my team. Um, I'm going to count on that for my assistant coaches, and I think we're going to we're going to build something along those lines. It's easy to say, and that's always the press conference answer: is we're going to we're going to have the hardest working team in the business, but we're going to try that. And if that's not the right words to do it, we're going to try something else, and and I think we'll be successful that way. The, the player that I want is someone who's going to be a student first. Um, here at Mercer, I think that's going to be really important. I think it's, I think being a competitive student leads to being a competitive athlete. I think it leads to a maturity initially that I would like to see for our team as we sort of turn the corner here at Mercer. And, and of course, I'd like great volleyball players, but I think we can manage great volleyball players as long as we get, as, we're, as long as we recruit hard workers that are willing to sacrifice a little bit, the, the volleyball part will come right after that.